Hi, first graders. It is Miss Angles, Mrs. Peak, Miss Comia, and Dr. J wished she could be here, but she's not here right now. But she says hi to all of you. And we have another read aloud from Epic that we are going to do today. And this book is called The Pirate Tree, and the author is Brigitta Oral, and it's illustrated by Jenny Poe. So let's get started. And while we read today, make sure to do your five finger re retell the characters, setting, what happened in the beginning, in the middle, and at the end. The gnarled up tree on the hill sometimes turns into a pirate ship. A rope serves as an anchor, a sheet as a sail, and Sam is its fearless captain. Today the tree watches as another sailor approaches. Can I play? Agu asks, standing on the ship's leeward side. Sam hoists the sheet up over the branch and glares. I don't know you. You're not from my street. Agu's face falls. He watches her struggle with a thick rope. No one wants to play with him because he's a newcomer. Beware, here come pirates, Sam yells, Arr. When Sam doesn't as much as look, oh, as look his way, Agu's shoulders slump. And he tells him to be patient, but he's been patient for days. We go sailing the warm South Seas, Sam sings, stealing cargo off mighty ships, robbing diamonds in Nigeria, gold from, Agu snorts, there are no diamonds in Nigeria. Sam pauses, the sheet collapses as she lets go of the twine. How do you know? I used to live in Nigeria, Sam's eyes widen, then she frowns. Mm, what else do you know? I sailed on a ship, I can tell you about it. I can tell you about it, Agu says, his voice rising. Sam shuffles her feet, scratches her head, and pulls on her ear. Come on then. They set sail again. The breeze is generous and the ocean is wide before them. They land on a deserted island and find fresh coconuts and precious seashells. Agu shows Sam how to reef the main sail when the wind gets fierce. They spar with mean pirates from a rival ship and win. They are about to round Cape Horn when dad calls from the yard. Sam, dinner time! The cook is calling from the galley, Sam says. Let's go and see what he's caught. Agu coils the thick rope Sam uses for an anchor. What's your name then? Sam asks, bunching the sheet under her arm. I'm Agu. They set off down the slope, treading through the waves of grass. Cool name for a pirate, Sam says. It means tiger. Sam grins at her new crew member. You'll sail with me again, won't you? They are too far away for the tree to hear Agu's answer. It bows sigh in the zephyr, waiting for the day it will turn into a pirate ship once again and sail the distant seas with two new friends. The end.